Victor channel, it's Alyssa right now, and today we're going to be trying Locals Espresso. So, I got a cookie, like a summer cookie that they had, and I got a Ripper Float. It was, I don't know exactly what it was called, but it was like Ripper Float something else, but it looks pretty good, and um, I've, I love Ripper Floats, so this should be really good, and I'm excited to try it. Before we get started, don't forget to like this video and subscribe and turn on notification bell so you don't miss out on all of our new videos. This is what the cookie looks like. It looks really good. It's like I don't think it I don't think it tastes like lemons, but it just like like it they decorated it like it. So anyways, I'm gonna taste I'm gonna eat this soon or eat this now, probably first, and then I will try my drink. It was really good. It definitely rated out 10 out of 10. It didn't taste like lemon, it just like basically tastes like a regular sugar cookie um, that you would usually get. Not like a crumble cookie or anything, it's definitely different than that. It just, I don't know exactly how to explain how it tastes, but it just tastes like a normal sugar cookie. I rate it 10 out of 10. Um, I really like how they decorate it. It's really nice, like, look for it, and I just really like it. it um, so yeah, I'm gonna go try my drink now tastes really good it basically just tastes like a ripper float like i expected it to taste which is really good so i would rate this about a 9.5 because i kind of knew what it was going to taste like but it's really good um regardless so anyways um this place was really good um i basically rate everything was a pretty good like like rating what i rated it so um yeah they have other breakfast options like just several things i think they change it a lot i'm pretty sure so i think you just gotta ask them like what kind of stuff like bakery options that they have because they change it a lot the drinks i pretty much just stay the same but they have like a lot of menu options like a lot of menu options like almost like a regular like like just coffee like place not like a stand like a regular like just coffee place that you would go to like starbucks no i mean it's not exactly it's not starbucks but it's just like they have a lot of many options like starbucks not as much but similar but anyway so this is a pretty cool place i really like like their logos and stuff is pretty cool um it just reminds me of like more like a summer like vibe because like they have a lot of like um like like, even their cups, like, they have, like, flowers on them. It just reminds me of, like, summer theme stuff, so which is cool. Um, they also have so many Frappuccinos, so if you're interested in Frappuccinos and other drinks, they also have, like, the Italian sodas that everybody has, or gets the stands. That's probably it for this video pretty soon, but anyways, I'm going on a trip pretty soon here. I'm not going to tell you where yet, or I'm just keeping a surprise when I'm doing the videos, but... Anyways, so stay tuned for those pretty soon. Um, this video will probably be before my trip videos, so stay tuned for that. I'm really excited it's summer, and you already know that, but anyways. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you are planning to try it here, or if you have tried here, or have tried any of our other coffee stands or coffee places that we have been to. Anyways, bye. See you guys next week. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. It's Brooke right now, and so today, like, we're doing, like, a summer food and drinks video, and so at Starbucks, they have this new chicken and, like, it's, it's like this chicken, maple butter, and egg sandwich, but so when we went up to order it, they said that they were all out, and there was, like, a shortage of them, because I guess it's so popular that they have none left or something. And so they said they aren't going to have any more for a while because it's like, I guess it's that popular. So the whole point of this video was me supposed to be doing it on that new summer sandwich. But because <laughs> they don't have it and they're not going to have it for a while, I had to pick like a different sandwich that I haven't had before. And so today I got like this sandwich and what was it again? Yeah, it's a turkey bacon gouda sandwich, so hopefully it tastes good. It's burning my hands, though, so I had to put that back down. And then I got this drink, which is the one I get all the time. And this is the mocha cookie crumble, but substitute with white mocha. So this is, like, part of their summer, like, menu and everything, too. But obviously not with the white mocha part, but <laughs> I like putting that part in because it tastes better. <laughs> I think it tastes good. So that's usually what I get. And so we've had like multiple videos on this one before. But it's definitely really good and my favorite Starbucks drink ever that I've ever had here. So that's pretty cool too. <laughs> okay, 
Reese's sandwich is definitely really good. The eggs are like super fluffy and so it definitely tastes, it's kind of interesting because I don't think like I usually have eggs that are kind of like that, but it's definitely really good. The sandwich that I like always got was like a turkey bacon and cheddar like an egg sandwich, but this one is turkey bacon and gouda and egg and they have like a different bread that they use for this one and the eggs are definitely like different <laughs> in this one like it, it definitely tastes really good it's just like the eggs are just like I guess I haven't had eggs that taste like this before <laughs> on like any of the other sandwiches here so that's definitely really interesting but it's not bad I think it definitely tastes pretty good and obviously you guys already know what I think about the drink but I'm just gonna talk about that maybe just a little bit anyway <laughs> because the first video that I ever made on that drink was definitely like not really good because we were very good at like filming and doing YouTube videos at the at like that time so definitely like two seconds or something it was like 50 seconds but yeah basically the same thing okay so this drink is like if you've ever had like mocha you crumble or any chocolate like frappuccinos it's or chocolate milkshake even it's basically kind of like that except like with more like white chocolate flavor so if you ever had white chocolate it kind of like has more of that flavor with the coffee and it's definitely so good so if you definitely like anything like that you'll definitely like this drink and also emily from emily's vlogs also tried this drink and i think she really liked it she gave it 10 out of 10 i'm pretty sure <laughs> So it's definitely really good. So you should also watch that video too from Emily's channel if you want to. It's like one where we did like a collab and we also tried her drink. And that was also really good. It tastes kind of like the milk cookie crumble but with caramel. So that's definitely really cool. But yeah, this has always been like my favorite drink ever since I got it. Which I went to like Hawaii and when we were coming back from that trip. And they, I guess in the airport, they didn't have any like mocha sauce left or something. And so they're like, well, do you want to use like white mocha? And I'm like, okay. And, like, I wasn't really excited about that. <laughs> like, I really like the mocha from I didn't think it was going to taste good. And then I tried it and it was literally so good. And now I've had it like ever since. But yeah, that's just like a little short, short like story about that. But it's definitely so good. And you should definitely try it if you ever go to Starbucks. Oh, and also if you're uh, wondering... <laughs> Um, this does still have everything the same in it like it still has like all the crumble pieces and everything The only difference is like instead of like mocha It's white mocha sauce that they put in here instead Which is why it's like lighter, but everything else is the same and even it still has like the chocolate like sauce on the top So like if you order this and they're like you still want like some baristas or like They'll just be like yeah, like you can do that and then other baristas will be like do you still want like the cookie crumbles or whatever and stuff in it and that's just a little bit weird, maybe just a little bit, but you just say you just want everything the same and just with the white milk instead. I mean, unless you don't like having the crumble pieces in your drink or whatever, I guess, like, just do you or whatever. <laughs> but that's just, like, if you just want it, like, the same as this one, that's basically just what I do. Anyway, that's it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, even though I didn't, like, have the sandwich I was supposed to try. Like, I mean, I think that this new sandwich, like, was gonna be pretty good. I mean, it sounded kind of interesting, because, like, they didn't have, like, a sandwich like that. Like, with that chicken and stuff in it. Or maple butter. Like, I haven't even heard of that before. I don't know what that is. But I'm pretty sure it would probably taste good if it was at Starbucks. <laughs> so, I mean, there's only one thing that I've ever gotten from there that I have not liked. And that was a green thing. <laughs> Anyways. We have a video on that on the channel, but it was not very good, so I don't watch it. <laughs> but, I hope you guys enjoyed this video anyways, and it's definitely really cool now that it's like summer and it's really nice. And so we'll definitely have some other cool summer, like, videos and everything coming out soon. So hopefully you guys like those too, because it's definitely going to be really cool. You should definitely stay tuned for that. Anyways, we'll see you guys next time.